This place. Ours is a meeting long overdue. Full glad am I that we may finally speak. My dear, sweet child. Yours is a burden none should ever be forced to bear. Such pain and suffering you have endured. Yet still you came. For this and more, I thank you. I've lost count of the times I've almost given up. If people hadn't helped me every step of the way, I never would have made it. Yet here you stand, resolved. Now, tell me your heart's desire. To defeat the Sin Eaters, and bring this world back from the brink. The remaining Wardens have hidden themselves from us. But with the power of the Oracle, I thought we might be able to find them. Indeed you could. Their radiance would be unmistakable. But know, my child, that the power you seek will come at a price. We stand now at the crossroads. A decision must be made. Tis only natural to be afraid, to hesitate. But for your many trials, you have grown stronger and wiser. And with the love and support of those you hold dear, you have grown to love yourself. Blood has washed away so much of this world. So many people and places and possibilities, and all the heroes who fought to protect them. Yet here the Scions are, trying so, so hard to help those few of us who remain, and seeing how tirelessly they work, how completely committed they are to the cause. I can't help but believe. I want to do more than just watch and cheer. I want to make a difference. I want to help them like they helped me, and maybe even inspire others to do the same. Coming together, providing for one another. That's the only way forward I can see. Since all of our heroes are gone, We'll just have to make heroes of ourselves. Tis a beautiful, wonderful dream. One we share. Though my power was all but spent in staying the flood, I prayed this final act would give hope to those who survived. Self-same hope lives on in you. It gives me comfort to know that the future is in capable hands.
If ever you should falter, remember this. No one, however powerful, is immune to the whisperings of doubt and despair. Do not give in to them. But do not deny them either. Look instead to the light within, that you may continue to serve as a beacon to others. Thank you, Menphilia, for believing in us, for believing in me. Dearest friend, no words can express my gratitude to you for keeping her safe in these tumultuous times. You are a hero to us both. But not even the most valiant heroes can stand alone. Only together may you change the fate of two worlds. <laughs>